Yo, what's going on, guys? RIP, and uh, I do have uh, a tutorial today, but before I get on with that, uh, I know I did not double upload. That was uh, just because I had a lot of stuff going on, um, like in my life. But, anyways, uh, the tutorial is about making a multi backup, and I meant to do this a while ago. But, uh, I'm still having a little trouble with the comments, uh, like, a couple things, other comments. But, what is required is hex edit, which that's for the comments. Um, patch editor, uh, .ff patch editor, which, these will all be included. Um, and a PS3 export, which that'll be included. PS3, that's yours. Uh, PS3 controller, television. Uh, of course, a television, of course, a computer, and a uh, mouse. Uh, so, um, you need to uh, go to Passive Modding channel, um, which he would be right here. Uh, to, to know how to do the base backup, which I will include the base backup already, but if you want to know how to make a full-on comment, um, that would be right here. That link would be down in the description, so just check there. Also, the download link for this will be down in the description. And also, I am making this backup for a friend, so it's not like for like a fit, like a subscriber or something, but it is for a fan or not a friend. Um, it's just for a friend. I made a, a backup, and I figured since it's a perfect time to record on it. So, Modern Warfare 2, he wanted Seeking Spazi, COD 4 is Grimsake patch, which that's the new one uh, that Chris48x just recorded. Um, he just uh, recorded that video. But, um, what is what at war, I'm not decided. But, uh, it would probably be Kush V4, V4, and that is made by, um, I think, it's either going to be iPro Family, um, Purple Kush, oh my bad, Purple Kush, no, that does not look, <laughs> sorry, but, uh, Purple Kush V4, or it's going to be X, Elite mods or Fufala, whatever patch. But anyways, uh, not decided. <laughs> I'm good with that for now. But, uh, three jailbreak PKGs, which is Multiman, Black Box, and Rebug Toolbox. Five comments. The first profile is my friend's. Second is mine. And the three, uh, the three other extra ones that you guys get are for you. And those are pre-made. Uh, or unless if you want to change it, I'll show you how. Um, Hulu packages. Uh, I watch Hulu a lot, so that's for uh, me. Um, but e it's still public. But I just added Hulu. I mean, if you're just wondering why Hulu's there, it's just because I watch Hulu a lot, so, and, and I don't keep wanting to download it. And all I, when all I have to do is just click into Hulu and just install the update, and then it just goes to the update because um, I don't have the uh, the original update for Hulu. Like the PKGs, like the, I can't remember what the update is, like 1.04 or something like that, but uh, YouTube is 1.12, and I have like 1.10, 1.9 or something like that, but just delete YouTube and install to actually watch it. Um, it's just for show, because I renamed YouTube, and Astro CFG, uh, he made a, uh, a uh, tutorial on how to like rename YouTube, so I did that, and then it just doesn't work. But uh, let's get out of that. So here I have all the uh, patches already in pre folders. Uh, these are just these two because what at war is already added. Because I, I I currently have uh, purple kush uh, already in there, but I also will include this is the base backup. I will get on to that in a second, but let me just open the one I'm going to edit off of. Um, let's see. I do have a lot of crap in my USB. 
Uh, let's see. It's not that hard to tell. <laughs> but uh, if you go up here, and here's my backup, and here's my PS3 folder. My PS3. Also, this is what you guys will get. So I will also include the base backup so you guys can edit the comments if you want. If you don't like the comments, uh, mine uh, just says just figure it out. <laughs> I, I don't I don't know what. I haven't been on PlayStation like a couple days, but if uh, you don't like it, I'll show you how to edit it. Uh, I won't show you how to do all the tutorial. Just uh, that's why I'm gonna include both of these in the description. He also, uh, hey, just pause that. He also includes a download for one I made earlier, and that's where I got it off of. So, um, you uh. This is just his backup that I got, and, uh, yeah, so, uh, you can just get this easily without making it, but if you guys want to make it off your own, then you guys can, um, so, when you go to, crap, oh, that's not what I wanted, uh, okay, go to my USB, and then go to RP, it dev, and then go to game, and this is all your games. Um, I think you can tell Rebug Toolbox is here. I think NPub is both of the media, like which is Hulu and YouTube. Um, yeah, both of the NPubs are YouTube. That's Hulu. And the 1028 is uh, YouTube. Er, uh, 00046 is Hulu. 10028 is um youtube uh bless ble bless uh you don't need to worry about these two files they will work because these are the jailbreak pkgs bluff is what you need to worry about because these are your games uh nine two um okay trophy i think this is cod four no whatever uh my bad but okay so just go and click it and just click the icon and you'll see so when you edit a patch um you have to put it in both, I think, the, wherever you get the patch. Yeah, I think you have to put it in both, in the French and English. That's just what I do. So, just do that. But, uh, when you go in here, 30377, of course, that's Modern Warfare 2. Modern Warfare 2. So, of course, there's only one patch to edit. So, uh, this is Modern Warfare 2. So, I'm also going to include these both of these folders in here. All these folders will be in the download. So, this is Speak and Spazi. So, I'm just going to drag the patch in here. And also, you can do this with anything. With any patch. Um, if you want to do bypass, just delete this one right here. Just delete the default underscore mp dot self. You will need to do a PKG, another PKG when you want to get back on. What the heck was that? I have no idea. Um, <laughs> sorry about that. But uh, when you uh, go on bypass, you have to delete the MP.self, which I'll include PKGs. So all you have to do is drag the plus in here and just hit replace all. And then you'll get the default mp self back so that'll get you back on 1.14 oh. but and then if you want to change 1.14 patches just drag the patch dot ff in here also uh, i'll go into i'll show you how to change the name so when you go in ofw mods uh this is everything that's included it's by elusive uh ds dot store i don't think you need, yeah you don't need to worry about that so uh, FF viewer, uh, this is what you need. So just open up the .exe. And just close out of that. And just put that open. I may have to. Oh. Nope, but. So you're gonna go into fast file. And then you're gonna open fast file. And then you're gonna go wherever this is. So we're gonna go wherever the patch is that you want to edit. So mine is, I'm just going to edit the YouTube stuff, uh, so which is this, the, the folder that where I originally got Seek and Spazi from, 
So I'm gonna op I'm gonna just open up the .ff and hear all the stuff or the um different uh selections you got, but you just find the one where the menu's mainly at or where the perks are at. Usually it'll have like perks.cfg, like something like that. Um no, it's not here, but it's only in dual patch. So you're gonna scroll down where he has like exposed bullets. And you're just gonna find where like so where our perk is or where you where you required need a name. So that would be hunt seek like right here. So set perk and then this is the name right here. Hunt seek. So you're gonna press control C and then control H. And then it'll auto do the find what. So you're gonna do find what as the name, which is haunt seek, and then you replace it with your PSN. Not actually this, just replace it with the actually like your PSN, like okay, my friend's PSN is Y Avery. So I'm just gonna do that. And then it just hit replace all, and then it'll go through all the perks, and then you get explosive bullets. Um, as you can see it replaced. So then you're gonna if you have this, uh File editor, you're gonna hit save current GSC. After that, um, hit save file, fast file as, and then just wait for it. And then just hit and just save it as a patch dot f, patch underscore mp dot ff, and then hit save and hit yes, replace, and then just hit okay, and then just close out. You don't need that. Uh, but you're gonna open up uh, wherever the backup is in case it's the folder I gave you so it's right here which I will replace this whatever I put in my USB I'll replace with that since I have the same folders so I just have to replace with my USB with that and then like that but anyways so you're gonna drag what you just edited which is right here and you're just gonna drag it right in where where your uh, file destination is where uh, your uh, um, your what, um, dev underscore HDD is, which is right here, which is just the folder where you keep all your multi stuff is. Um, so you want to back up and go wherever your COD four is, which COD four I'm gonna uh, which is seven zero three hundred and seventy two, which you can just click in all the bless folders and just find where COD four is, and then. Uh, just hit X out of that, but then you're just gonna go in here and just replace the patch. You do not need a zone edit or er, zone it. You do not need to edit um uh, COD four patches as they already it works like Modern Warfare two bypass and stuff menus like that. You, you already have your name in them and stuff. Um, you do not need to edit that those kind of menus in the FF viewer. I would not try. Um, it's pretty stupid, but <laughs> but. Anyways, uh, if you want to, let's get on to the comment. So if you want to edit the comments that I give you, uh, you just go into hex edit. Um, just you got that. I gotta close out of that. Uh, you can either drag or open in from a file. So you're gonna go wherever the multi uh, folder is and go home. And these are your profiles. So. Third, it's from the top to bottom are there are your profiles. So the top is one profile, the bottom is the second profile, the thirty-seven is the third profile, thirty-eight is the fourth, thirty-nine is the fifth, or er, fourth, and then forty is the fifth. I got mixed up there. But anyways, so I'll just show off mine, which is that's the thirty-six. So M E comment dot dot. And you're gonna go in here. And then um, this is mine. I'm on Rebug Hose, so you can suck dick. So you can suck dick. So you can go here, and then go to wherever he made the tutorial on, which is modded comment tutorial. So I'm gonna include on the back on the description, um, modded comment tutorial. Uh, the week of thing. greatness came back strong this year. Got to. You Stupid ad, but <laughs> but he does include all the uh, coding. The hex, so I'm just gonna get out notepad real quick and then go back in. My bad. So you're just gonna go back in. Oh, oh I already had it open. My bad. So then you're just gonna uh, open up a new one and then minimize, minimize that. 
and you open up, of course, open up your new one. And I will also include these codes in the, here, I'll give credit also. So I'm also going to include all these codes in the multi I give you. Why is that working? So the folder I give you, it's going to have all of these hex codes in here. So you're going to press control C and then just paste them in here. Uh, the font will be changed depending on your computer. It's just because I typed out that uh, thing. It won't be this big. It just depends on your computer. So I'm just going to name it X codes dot fixed. And then you're just going to put on your desktop. Hit save. And save. So you're going to X out. And I do recommend watching this. Yes, watch this, because it tells you exactly how to do it if you do not do, know how to do comments. Uh, also, um, if you go, uh, I think it's local username, you can change what the username is, because you cannot do that. So, say, like, uh, you need HXD editor, which I do not have at the current moment, but I will make a current, that's just how you zone edit uh, patches with hxd editor i do not i don't want to download that uh, i won't pause the video or anything it's not that important but anyways just uh you know just watch the video and then see what you're doing because i don't i don't it's hard to explain and i don't feel like making this video longer yeah than it is so when you exit out of that and you got your comment done you can go ahead and open up PS3 export. And then when you do that, you're going to hit. Also, I will include PS3 export already in here. And it would come with the keys.config and PSI, psid.bin already in here. So. PSID. You're going to hit open, and you're going to hit psid.bin right here, and keys.config right here. Oh, I opened up another one. So, just open up this, and just click the first, oh, not that. Open, just press open on the second one. You don't have to worry about device ID. Don't, I, yeah, you don't have to worry about that. Do not do anything with that. It'll screw it up, but hit psid.bin, hit open, and then just hit the first for the first dot then that comes hit create a backup right here you should say create a backup just bubble that hit output directory make sure this is your USB that is important so hit this piece PC hit removable disk and then find wherever your PS3 folder is so PS3 can folder export backup and then modded backup and you do not need to back up your PlayStation for this. Make sure there uh, there's nothing in the backup folder. After export, you have to make another folder after that. Of course, everybody knows that. In that folder that you create for where you put the archives, do not uh, make sure there's archives in there. Or PS3 export will not make the backup. So content directory, of course, that's where all your patches and PKGs are. And you're just going to go here and RIP. Uh, which right here and just hit start and this takes oops hit yes so this takes a while because uh th there's a lot of stuff in this so i'm gonna go ahead and pause the video and resume it when it's completed and then we can move on to the next steps see it okay <laughs> no bad so <laughs> okay guys so when you um when you uh when it's finally done after like freaking like one through three seven years, but uh, after it's done, just hit all right, just hit okay, and hit X, and then I also, if you notice different time or anything, but I also put out instructions because I do not have an E3 flash or a shitty quality, and I don't feel like merging two videos together and it's taking longer to edit. But on your PlayStation, just go on your PlayStation. So I'm, just, I'm gonna make that clear. Go on your PlayStation. Uh, plug in USB and write slot. This is important or it would not work. Go to settings. Go to system settings. Hit restore. Hit your USB and hit file, which is the modded uh, in the brackets. It's modded. And then in another bracket, instead of brackets, it's backup. Just hit that. Hit yes. And follow everything. 
on the instructions on the PlayStation. And I am warning you that this will move everything. Well, not everything. It will not remove everything like pronounce it remove uh, so so I'm gonna make a little warning thing And let's make this let's make it even look even more snazzy. Let's make that down there. Let's make this right there. Just make this look a lot better, you know. You know you gotta Alright. So uh remove a couple of these. <laughs> but so after that, oh I have no idea. But uh, so I also include a whole modded backup pack that will include a backup and This will include all the stuff that went over it will not include hex edit But it will include the dot exe where you have to download it off of which in it uh, So hang on just give me a second And I'm just going to save this to my desktop, and it should go right under here. Yep. So, this is all the stuff I will add. Um, it will be hex edit, but it won't be hex edit. It will be uh, .zip, which is the download, or the program download, which you have to download, like, where you have to open it, and then you, that's the installer for it. So, and it'll also include uh, those OFW mods with free PKGs, or, and, or, no, with free PKGs and uh, the tools, and uh, it'll, it'll, uh, free uh, tools, free, K, uh, free uh, 1.14 uh, PKGs. Uh, it'll also include 1.14 plus 1.11 patches. It'll include Pextle Point, but that's Usually, if you're doing like one backup, not usually multi. I don't know. It just looks better if you use PS3 export. Um, PKG view. Uh, that's just if you get uh the PKGs like uh just like normal PKGs like that's what I'm trying to say. But uh, so also this all the PKG. Oh gosh, I I dragged it out. <laughs> I got that. But It'll also include just Modern Warfare 2 PKGs, but you really shouldn't need PKGs anyways. So I don't know what happened to that file, and it will never be found. If you guys found it, you drop a like. But, just kidding. But, anyways, uh, so, uh, if you go, just a review of what this will contain. So, if you go into my USB, it'll contain, of course, the multi-backup, which you can change. It'll contain basically all this stuff right here in one, and it also include the. I uh, forgot to show that. So if you're going to remove a disk, go down, go to PS3, go to export, go to backup, go to modded backup, modded backup, and then just go to archive.dat, and then they're all there. Just you're good after that, as long as the archives are there. Which I have to make this more time, so it's not gonna go straight to downloading. S but because I have to fix up my comment from my friend. Uh, so, anyways, that's all I have for today. And peace.